just east of you is uh, Tony Russell, who is watching this as well on western portions of Tulsa County, Sand Springs, matter of fact. Uh, Tony, give us an update on what you're seeing with the snow right now. Yeah, drastic conditions. You know, uh, this is this is the spot if you are trying to catch the flurries out here on the, this side of the viewing area. I mean, we're starting to see some of that snow again. The slush is building up on the roads, and you know, I think just kind of one of the things. You know, just because you got the four-wheel drive option on your car doesn't mean you need to go out and use it, and that doesn't mean you're invincible to uh, the winter weather. That's not going to stop you at, at all. So just to just to think, because I got four-wheel drive, and you know, I know I'm going to use it obviously when I get home today, and I'm going to try to be safe. But that doesn't mean you can go 55 miles an hour down Highway 75. You're you're a mess to everyone out there. So please, 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 everybody, slow down and take it easy this morning, regardless of the type of vehicle that you have, because you're gonna see some of that, those messes that you're seeing reported earlier from our friends that are sending in our photos and some of the video out here. Um, you know, here out in Sand Springs, Highway 97 and 412, you know, I'm, I'm actually pretty impressed with the lack of traffic. I know that sounds crazy, but I'm really happy that people are are, are, are being diligent this morning and taking it really slow. Um, I, I'm gonna tell everybody like I've been telling them all morning long, we're gonna be watching those bridges and those overpasses. I'm really concerned about some of our traffic out on Highway 97 over the Arkansas River Bridge. So all of our friends in Prattville this morning, if you need to get on the north side of Sand Springs, please, please, please take it slow. We're, we, we have seen some plow trucks up there uh, in terms of how, they've been, how the road's been treated up there. Um, if this is any indication, if 97 without the bridge is any indication, imagine what the bridge with all that cold air blowing underneath it could be. And then Mike, you know, just, just once we started to see the snow start to fall this morning, you know, a lot of that stuff is just sticking, sticking, sticking hard here on the grass. And uh, like, like, uh, like Mike Scantlin said, we're probably seeing close to an inch, close to an inch of snowfall already here in Sand Spring. Man, it's cold. I'm gonna go inside and uh, get in my truck and get a new <laughs> pair of gloves because the ones that I got right now, they're soaked. They're soaked. It, you know, Tony, it's a good big wet snowfall. These are big wet flakes that are falling. Good snowman, you know, compactors that you can make, good snowball fights with <sighs> the snow. Uh, we continue to watch this snow across the area.